Oh, there he is. Oh, there. Put him on your shoulder and keep him snuggy warm. He's cuddling in my hair. Just like Sky used to do. You can find good, good in everything. All right, guys. What is up? All right. So, update on this whole bird situation. So, okay. April, little mom. So, last night, Daisy was like, Mom, I really want a bird. <laughs> She's like, I just want another one. Well, it's tearing us up inside Here's the thing. too. Like it's so sad. Uh, we've had pets die before, but it was just kind of like total. And this is a total accident too. But I've never been the one that it was like. I like. I I know I shouldn't blame myself, but I'm like. I feel like it's my fault. Like I really do. I just feel like I cannot live without seeing Daisy's little bird on her shoulder. Like, I can't handle not seeing a little bird on her. Because she did get happy, like me and her had a lot of fun, but then after everything slowed down, she and they went, on her just bed when and she was on her bed, bed, it was just sadness. But and then as soon as I said, do you want to get another bird, she perked up and was like, yes. I said, well, it's not going to be the same. It's going to, you have to train it. And and we started looking online, we could not find anything. And I, I was just like, oh, what are we going to do? And then I thought maybe I should just call the breeder that I got Sky from. And I looked up on his website and there wasn't any birds. Like they didn't have any. But then I just texted him and I was like, do you have any parallettes right now? And before that, Daisy was talking about it in her room and she was like, if I got another one, maybe I would get a boy. Maybe I would get a little bit different color. Like she wants it to be different. And I, I was like, that's nice, that sounds good. I'm like, but when we find someone that has them, you'll just have to pick from the ones they have. And she was like, okay. So I texted the guy and this is his response. I said, do you have any parallettes? And he says, I have one. And I said, how old, the gender, the color, how much? And he says, he is a little older, which I got immediately excited because I told Daisy, I'm like, it's gonna be really hard to go back to a baby bird because you can only hold a baby bird like 15, 20 minutes a day before you have to put it back in the cage to make sure it's eating and drinking and sleeping for a while. You, it, they're just a lot of work and they're really hard to keep alive. And so I was like, that'll be a hard adjustment, but we can do it. But then when I heard he's a little older and he, I was like, it's a boy and he's a little older already. So she could just go right into holding him. He goes, I was keeping him to be a breeder because I liked him so much, but I never got around to finding him a mate. And I have a couple other single ma males that need a mate more because they're not as friendly as he is. And he is a really neat little guy. He's an American turquoise pied and very friendly. We all just started crying. Yeah, <laughs> like, it was like, I was just like, wow. oh my gosh, this is perfect. And then you got to see a picture of this cute little bird. Yeah. God didn't stop this from happening or whatever but now he's we're finding comfort in this miracle of finding a bird the exact thing from we the wanted, same breeder which same means breeder. it could even be related to sky somehow and we're gonna go look at it at 7 30 tonight because and it, it just like even seeing the pictures of this little guy it gave her it put she goes i smile. want to name him rainbow and then she goes what's rainbow in mexican or in spanish and it was arc Arco Iris. Arco Iris. And she was like, oh, I would love to name him Iris or Arco Iris. Or... Okay, wait, wait, wait. But um, I guess his name is already Perry, Perry, like Perry the platypus, because he makes the same sound as the platypus on Phineas and Ferb. So we might keep that too. But here's the other thing. Everyone was devastated. That Everyone loved that bird. Zade was just as devastated as yeah, Daisy. He was, was like full on so tears, sad. Sobbing. And I... Like he was taking care of it just as much as Daisy. We all love it. It's like a family member. And I know this doesn't replace it, but like we have to have a bird. We're all so in love with birds. And the fact that she's not allergic at all, like all the things that just happened, I just can't handle not having one. But we might not get this one. I'm waiting to see how they react together. If he's like really, he, the guy claims he's super friendly, so I think it'll be great. But if he's for some reason vicious towards her, or she just like doesn't like decides she doesn't want it when we get there. We might yeah. not get it, but we'll we'll go look at him tonight. Phone. I got my phone. Okay. And I have I to go grab phone. Avery from school because she's getting her teeth Dad, fixed I a little bit more from when she broke them. Okay. <laughs> Good job. And open. Did that taste bad, Avery? How was it? Was that okay? Didn't even cry. And your lip looks totally normal again. All right, all better. How do your teeth feel? Let's see him get real close to me. Oh, beautiful smile. Hey, Ambry. 
We gotta get some good stuff, healthy stuff for New Year's resolution. Celery. Celery, yes, that's the right track. How come you wear a coat to school today? It's freezing. I did, but I left it in the car. Oh, right, do you want my coat? Better? Good thing you aren't any shorter. It's almost touching the ground. Say hi, Oliver. <laughs> I want to say hi. I want to say hi. I want to say hi. Oh, hello, everybody. Is this a cold? Oh, this is. What is on my face? <laughs> oh, this is the window. This stuff. So right now we're going to look at um our, our um our cousins got a dog. We're going to see it and and then we're going to see um we're, we're going to look at a bird. It's gonna be so cute. He named it um. Perry, because it makes the sound that Perry the platypus does from Phineas and Ferb, like the same sound. But this, you want to name it Iris or something? Let's call him Paula. Paula wanna grab her? His full name will be Arco Iris Viator Organ. Oh, there's the pictures of him. I wanna see. <gasps> it's so cute. It, it looks, looks like sky. Yeah, they might be related. Look at his wings. It's so cute. Zoom in. So what do we decide on the name? Iris. Cool. Um, Iris? I want to name him Perry. Still up for dispute? I want to name uh, him Perry. Perry. His nickname is Perry. I like Perry. Yeah. And then when he goes after our food, we can make the music say dooby 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 doo. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we are gonna see the cutest puppy in the world. Where is he? Where is Sugar? Oh. Hello, Sugar. <laughs> Sugar. Come on in. Oh, the puppy? <gasps> oh, Sugar. Oh my God. Oh, oh, I am dying. Oh, it looks like a pink dog. Oh. <laughs> This is so cute. <laughs> oh, you're a cute puppy. Like, you is a cute them. puppy. What are you guys doing so up here? Cute. Just want to see sugar. Came to see the dog. You guys, oh, I have a I secret for you. That's actually oh, our dog. Yeah, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. No, it's ours. You can't you have it. The, my sister played the funniest prank on her twins when oh. she got them the dog, though. She told her other daughter, who's on a mission, about the dog, and then told her to tell the girls the truth when they lie to her. And anyway, she convinced the girls that she was just babysitting the dog for someone else who was getting it for Christmas. And then when they talked to their missionary on Christmas, they were like, let's prank Tori and tell her we got a dog. And it really was their dog, but they sat there and like told Tori about their dog and she finally broke it to them that it was really their dog. And it's like the cutest video ever. Look how cute she is. Is this a boy or a girl? It's a girl. It's a girl. Sugar is loving anything tool. I'm like, sugar. EB's two twos, she keeps getting them. Oh, she's going. Sugar. Sugar. That's not for you. No, no, sugar. That's the. Dancing my body does to that sound you're making. Oh, hi, Perry. Is Perry coming home with us? I think he needs to. Daisy, we didn't get the bird, but we got a new pair of shoes. <laughs> Daisy, how do you feel? Happy. I like seeing that smile. Buckle up. Again, Daisy. Buckle up. Oh, there he is. Oh, there. Put him on your shoulder and keep him snuggy warm. Let's call him Perry. Perry? The platypus? Perry. Perry. Here's the name, he's like, huh, what? He's, he's so pretty. Good. What, Daisy? He's cuddling in my hair. Just like Sky used to do. <laughs> Did you tell him what the guy actually said about his bird's name? I almost started crying. He said, Sky, huh? Wow, that's really interesting. When I first hatched this little guy, I named him Sky. And, I, and it was so weird because I kept calling him Sky for about three months and I finally was just one day like, nope, that's not his name. Sorry, Evie, are you... She's sad because she's not holding the bird. Um, he said, I just finally decided that's not his name and I changed it to Perry because he was making the Perry the platypus sound. 
but very interesting that his original name was Sky. I feel like he was just saved for you, Daisy, for a rainy day when you needed another Paralette. <laughs> and it's so sad that, that this happened, but I feel like it's just like a tender mercy to be able to find the perfect bird, one that like is the same age as Sky. He said that she, he, this one was hatched right after her and he's super sweet. It's like, she doesn't have to go through that hard, like biting mean stage at all. Cause birds are kind of like scared and territorial and mean when you first get them, especially when they're babies and they're hard to keep alive. So it's just so wonderful that she doesn't have to go through the hard part anymore. She just got. Is he snuggling in there, dude? Oh, he is no. so cute. He's just like Sky. Turn, look that way. Oh, Daisy, his little tail sticking out. <laughs> He's so cute. Oh, Evie. Are you getting on? Okay, you can take her off. Perry. Daisy, can I hold Perry? Perry's so cute. Just name a bird. That's the name of bird, huh? Let's put on Sky's cage. Yeah. And she likes toys. He likes it's toys? He's a boy. Welcome home, Perry, or Iris, whatever your name is. All right, well, Perry, welcome home, Daisy. It's good to see that smile back on your face again. Um, show uh, Perry some love on the vlog, or Iris, whatever his name is, and... <laughs> Are you camera shy? He loves it. Well, you can't see him over there. No. He is there. on the camera screen right now. <laughs> Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Find good and everything. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>